Hi everyone, welcome to Life Made Simply. My name is Nikki. In today's video, we'll be talking all about the ultimate cutting crafting machine, the Cricut Maker. Hi everyone, I'm Nikki. If you're new here to this channel, I invite you to subscribe to join the Simple Life Society. I share home and lifestyle tips to help simplify your everyday life. You can also check down in the description box to follow me on Instagram, Made Simply Home. Today I'm talking about crafting and DIYs that I've been doing and I have been loving this Cricut Maker. So I wanted to thank Cricut for sponsoring this video and supplying this beautiful Cricut Maker and all of these supplies to help share more about the Cricut Maker with you. So this is the Cricut Maker. It is the machine that cuts the most materials and it's just a beautiful piece of machinery. I love how it's designed and how compact it is and you can cut and make a lot of projects with this. So my very first thought was when I would be working with the Cricut machine, all I wanted to do was label all the things. If you've been following my channel for a while, you know that I love to share DIY organization types of videos. I am most excited to work with this machine because it is so versatile and there's always new things that I can learn how to make. So I've been playing with the machine and I've been able to make a few different projects that I'm going to be sharing with you in this video. So this video isn't going to be so much of a tutorial but more of an overview of the projects that I see myself using with the Cricut machine, projects that I've already tried, mastered, and I'm definitely going to be making more, as well as why the Cricut machine is right for you. If you want to take a project and start it from scratch and design it on your own, the Cricut Design Space gives you all the tools for that. Or you can subscribe and get thousands of pre-made designs and images so you can just go ahead and start crafting right away. There's just so many possibilities with this machine depending on what type of crafter you are. If you just want to use it for cutting vinyl or paper or if you want to get more advanced and use it for engraving or embossing, the possibilities are just endless with this machine. I love that it can cut over 300 different materials and then you can also use the pen feature to draw. These are some of the different materials that I've been playing with. Um, I've been using a lot of vinyl as well as iron-on. These come in 12 by 12 sheets. I love that they have ones that have little samplers for you to try and the Cricut just has an amazing range of colors and materials for you to choose from. Another great product from Cricut that I've tried is their Easy Press. It comes with their Easy Press mat as well as the machine. Here is the Easy Press. Cricut made it even easier for you to do iron-ons and I love that you can do the temperature and the time and it heats up very quickly. Cricut also has a large selection of blanks that you can use for your projects including things like these coasters as well as like polyester shirts and everything that you can use for the finals. I also made some coasters here from their blanks using their infusible ink. So everything was just so fun and I've been able to just take on projects that I didn't know I was capable of because Cricut makes it that much easier. If you're a beginner and just wanting to start with a simple cutting machine to do some crafts but still with the versatility of being able to cut 300 or more materials maybe later on as you progress and learn more, I think the Cricut Maker would be the perfect machine for you. I will have links to the Cricut Maker machine down in the description box for you to shop and check out all of its great features. So without further ado, let's get on to the projects that I've created. I was not kidding when I said the very first thing I wanted to do was create some sticker labels. Here I have my airtight canisters in which I wanted to make some pretty labels for. I used Design Space to kind of make my own font combination which I really love the flexibility of it. And then here I'm just doing what they call weeding. And I've heard that it's quite relaxing or that's what people were saying and I kind of find it satisfying like weeding out all of the letters. And then I'm also using transfer tape. Everything was pretty simple and I love how I can just customize it to my own style. And then Design Space also has some already pre-made labels that you can choose from. Then I'm just pressing it on. I love the, how beautiful this came out and it's really just a dream come true to just transform something so easily. Thank you. 
After creating those sticker labels, I wanted to create more, so I had more fun on Cricut Design Space, creating this Simple Life Society graphic. I'm gonna put this on a plain reusable cup, and I use gold and black. I just love that color combination, and I love how you can customize it using your own fonts and play around with the designs, as well as use a mixture of the graphics that are already on Cricut Design Space. If you subscribe, Again, I'm doing the weeding. This flower had so many little pieces, but it's actually quite relaxing. And then here I'm placing it on the cup. I love that the grid helps me put it as straight as possible. And it comes out so pretty. I just wanna make more and more of these. I love how I'm able to personalize everything and I think this would be a really great gift idea. Now on to Iron On. I was really excited for this one, but since I'm new to it, I love that Cricut had a bunch of tutorials online walking me through it step by step. So I started with this pink, and then they also sent me some holographic Iron On, which I thought was so pretty. So what I'm doing is I'm making my daughter a t-shirt. She just graduated from preschool, and I wanted to give her something special. If you don't have the easy press, you can also use a regular iron for iron-on projects. And I love to play with all the different materials that this Cricut machine can cut. As you can see, I used two different sheens for this t-shirt and I love how it came out. You can also design on your mobile phone or tablet and connect to your machine via Bluetooth so you can design from anywhere. I almost bought a t-shirt that had this similar saying on it. I'm so glad I'm able to just make it at home and I love how easy it is to create your own custom t-shirts. Infusible ink differs from iron-ons because it actually infuses the ink into the material you're using. I'm using this beautiful watercolor sheet and I love the colors of this one. I chose this beautiful pre-made design and my plan was to remove the letters and have the heart shape and the negative letters be the print. And I thought it came out so beautiful. It says, love all the little things. And all I did was kind of bend it and I could pull the letters out easily. As a beginner, I was first intimidated by the infusible ink projects, but it is really not that different from doing all of the other projects. And the Easy Press made it really simple to do and did most of the work for me. And I just wanted to put this in here because if I can do it, you can do it. And I want to show you that even as a beginner, you can do really advanced projects. And when I removed the paper and everything, I was so in shock at how beautiful it came out and the ink is really infused in there and it came out so beautiful on this tote bag and this is just one of my favorite projects that I've done. I was really intrigued by these coaster blanks by Cricut that work with the infusible ink, so I wanted to show you guys how it turned out. I used the pre-made designs that were already on Design Space that fits the coasters perfectly. I wanted to show you how easy it is to set up and get started with the Cricut Maker and how it allows DIYers to do more. With the expanding suite of tools, there are endless possibilities and I can't wait to share more projects with you. I hope you were inspired from this video and will try some craft ideas using the Cricut Maker. I want to thank Cricut again for sponsoring this video and working with me and sharing these projects with you all. If you did enjoy this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and then check down in the description box for more information and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!